Hey everybody, what's up? So, the other day I posted a, a thread on Bungie.net about uh, what clans are considered the top 10, what clans are top 10, and uh, I actually got a decent amount of feedback. The idea here with what I guess I'm trying to do is um, every couple months, I don't know, I think one month might be too, too short, so I was thinking maybe every two to three months have a, a, a top 10 list of the top 10 clans in, in Destiny and uh, this way it gives clans um, I guess some kind of challenge outside of the game you know to look forward to I guess hopefully it's uh, as well received as it seems like it might be so uh, with that being said um, let's dive into uh, some of the clans here um, before we, we get into the top 10 um, there's a few honorable mentions that were mentioned in the post um, that I felt deserve, a, you know, at least a mention on here. Just so, you know, everyone knows, the way that I guess I decided to uh, to do this, or rank these clans or whatever, is based on uh, what people posted, the clans' community involvement, uh, friendliness, popularity, um, member size... I didn't really feel that that should be a deciding factor because you can have a hundred thousand members but if only five of them are active it's really kind of counterproductive so it was kind of looked at but not really held against or you know for or against any particular clan so uh, with that being said uh, let's dive into some honorable mentions here at the number 13 spot we have devise uh, they are located on clansofdestiny.com and coming in at number 12 we have the Dark Guardians uh, they are a group on bungie.net number 11 we have the Winter Collective they are also located on clansofdestiny.com and now we're gonna get into the top 10 and coming in at number 10 is boldly to the stars I haven't heard a lot from them lately but they uh, they are still relevant so they deserve at least to be in the top 10 and coming in at number nine is Knights of Aurora they are located on clans of destiny and coming in at number eight is Vox they were formed and located on GamingFall.com, which is an awesome site, by the way. Uh, I'm there constantly, and uh, I definitely recommend uh, checking that site out and uh, you know taking a look at them. Uh, there's some pretty cool guys there. So, and coming in at number seven, Legends of Earth. Uh, those guys there are all really helpful and friendly, and uh, some of them are kind of funny. And coming in at number six. TTL Gunslingers, yes, this is Deej's little group, clan, I guess, and um, everyone voted for him, so, uh, you know, they were mentioned a few times, so I figured we'd put him in there, uh, so congratulations, Deej, you made the list of the top 10 clans, but let's see if you can keep it. So, coming in at number 5, the 117th Regiment, uh, I've been seeing them recruiting pretty heavily lately. Coming in at number four, the Crossbone Vanguard. Uh, same thing, they've been recruiting a lot lately and uh, they seem to be some pretty cool guys. And coming in at number three, we have Starside Echoes. Um, they're another uh, really big, you know, clan community. And uh, some of their guys that I've talked to seem to be uh, really cool and, uh, and, you know, just uh, overall pretty nice. And coming in at number two is the Vanguardians, though their website is blocked to, I guess, for the public to see, they're still uh, one of the the bigger popular clans, so they got the number two spot. And coming in at number one, by clear choice, is Prime Guard. Congratulations to these guys because uh, almost everyone in the community has said that uh, they're probably the number one uh, the clan out there, and and most people uh, would agree that they'll probably last uh, the entire life cycle of Destiny. Um, not sure about any of the other ones, but uh, everyone's in favor of these guys, and uh, a lot of good things were said about them. So uh, congratulations to you guys on all your hard work, and. Um, 
I guess we'll uh, catch up after Destiny and uh, after Destiny is released and uh, we'll see if they keep the number one spot. Uh, thank you guys for the uh, information in the posts and uh, I hope to uh, keep doing this. So uh, let me know in the comments what you guys think and uh, I will talk to you guys later. Alright, peace.